On First Entering Westminster Abbey by Louise Imogen Guinea Read for LibriVox.org by Thomas Peter Holy of England, since my light is short and faint, O oh, rather by the sun anew of timeless passion Set my dial true, that with thy saints in thee I may consort, And wafted in the cool and shadowed port of poets Seem a little sail long due, and be as one the call of memory drew Unto the saddle void since Agincourt. court. Not now for secular love's unquiet lease, Receive my soul, who, wrapped in thee erewhile, Hath broken tryst with transitory things, But seal with her a marriage and a peace eternal On thine Edward's altar isle, Above the stormless sea of ended kings. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain. Fog by Louise Imogen Guinea. Read for LibriVox.org by Sonia. Fog. Like bodiless water passing in a sigh, through palsied streets the fatal shadows flow, and in their sharp disastrous undertow suck in the morning sun and all the sky. The towery vista sinks upon the eye as if it heard the horns of Jericho, black and dissolved. Nor could the founders know how what was built so bright should daily die. Thy mood with man's is broken and blent in, city of stains, and ache of thought doth drown the generous light in which thy life began. Great as thy dole is, smirch it with his sin, greater and elder yet the love of man, Full in thy look, though the dark visors down. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain.